Hey guys, it's Mikey and welcome back to my channel. Today is a very, very exciting day because today, in honor of the new Selena series coming to Netflix for season two, I'm going to be unboxing the new Selena Funko Pop. And I'm really, really excited about this because Selena is one of my all time favorite artists and it's not just because I'm Mexican myself, but I truly, truly love her music and I play it every single day. I'm even wearing my cute little Selena shirt that my friend Gabby got for me, so thank you, Gabby. But yeah, I just love her and her spirit so much. We're both airy. So I feel like I can really relate to her and her ambition and her drive and her all-around fun and creative spirit So yeah, here I am to bring you guys a little bit of Selena knowledge and let's get started So the cool thing about this pop when I got it was that it came in a box protector But if you get one that doesn't come in a box protector I would definitely recommend getting one because this pop is already going up in money So 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 much and I can obviously see why you know first of all She's this amazing amazing artist, but also she's an artist that came away from us way too soon So I can see why a lot of people want to get their hands on it And this one in particular is really amazing because it's the outfit from her last concert And also the box is super super cute and I don't know if you can see but it has little pink purple and white sparkles on there which is super cute and of course her name written in her signature cursive selena font which i love but yeah this one is super super amazing and i can already tell that i'm gonna love it so let's take it out of the box factor so right away when I opened the box, I found a cute little hidden treasure and right here when you open the tab It says BD BD bum bum and I think that that's super super cute And I don't know if that's something that they're doing on all the new pops But I noticed a similar theme on my Disneyland 65th anniversary pops or when you opened it The little tab right here had a little picture of the castle So that's super cute and if it's something you know what they're doing I really really applaud them for that because it takes a lot of time and detail to put that on so yeah But now that I take it out of the box we are down to the true hidden treasure of this gem which is the pop itself and already I can tell right off the bat that I love it so 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 much you can see her pretty little eyelashes as well as her signature red lipstick on the face already and her eyebrows do look really really amazing and I noticed that a lot of the pops on the more feminine characters are becoming really 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 well defined and I really really appreciate that because eyebrows definitely shape the face so that's cool and her nose is very very cute and plain just kind of like a normal pop nose but still very very adorable and yeah one thing that I love about this pop is her hair they definitely got the hair absolutely right she had a very special kind of hair where it wasn't straight but it wasn't curly and it was kind of that beautiful Latina wavy feel which I love and they got every single aspect of it right down to the little curls over the top and the way it just kind of folds at the bottom right here but you can see every little tendril going through it and I love that about it so much as well as her signature bangs which droop forward perfectly and and they're not perfectly straight bangs like hers, um, but they're a little bit more curvy and wispy, but I like that because I feel like she would do her live shows, her bangs would definitely start out super, super straight and pretty, and then by the end she would just get really, really sweaty because she was dancing so much and putting all her heart into it that they would get a little bit wavy. So I like that they did that, it was a nice little touch, and they definitely paid attention to that, so that's cool. But now we're on to the outfit, and as you guys know, Selena was a fashion designer herself. She would collaborate with a lot of different stylists to create her cool little look, but it all came from her mind and it was her vision which I love but this outfit is super super adorable and iconic I've seen so many people on Halloween recreate this look from normal people to celebrities so that's cool because it's definitely had a lasting impact but you can see the cute little crossed bustier top with the wrap around the neck which is adorable as well as the cowgirl flared bootleg jeans which I love and when I was watching the series with my mom recently she said that she misses wearing bootcut jeans and I agree I just think they look really really great on a woman's body and definitely curve her figure very nicely especially Selena's because she was more of a curvaceous woman but yeah it's super super adorable and I love her shoes as well I love how they're a little bit gray and silver just like how she wore them in the actual show which is awesome and it's a cute little detail on the side I don't know if you can see it but they put a little silver button on the side of the pants which is cool because I remember her actually having buttons up and down her legs when she did this but yeah super super cool and I love how her stance is a little bit slightly slanted this way because she definitely liked to put all her weight on one leg because she was a dancer so she had to really put her weight into one leg to swirl her hips around which I love but yeah and it's not just her clothes that's amazing on her body but it's her body herself because she has a little bit of a booty and she has her red nails which are so signature to her I feel like she always had her nails painted and it just reminds me of that scene in the movie where
where she said that she was going to give all her employees at her boutique free manicures which is really really cool and yeah i love it so much as well as the mic it's not just a regular black mic but it has a red lipstick stains on the top which i love because again her iconic red lips are just such a big part of her image and her personality so yeah this is a super super cool pop and i'm really really happy that i was able to get my hands on it because i love selena so much and i love the new netflix series contrary to what a lot of people have to say and i just think a lot of people are very judgmental and i think that's because you know a legend like jennifer lopez played the part years ago before and obviously jennifer did an amazing job and it can't be touched but kristen serrato the girl who plays selena this time around did an amazing job as well and i really give her a lot of props and yeah i think jennifer lopez and kristen serrato both did an amazing job and i feel like jennifer lopez definitely did the performance quality of selena a lot better but that's because of her dance background and her singing background but i feel like kristen serrato did a really great job um, with the acting she definitely studied i'll say that like she definitely studied her voice and her mannerisms a lot so i feel like jennifer lopez did a good job with the dancing and kristen serrato did a good job with the capturing of her spirit and her essence so they both really complete each other in amazing ways and i definitely definitely can't choose a favorite but I love them both I definitely recommend that you give the Selena series a try because Suzette Quintanilla Selena's sister actually executive produced it so you know it's not just coming from a place of wanting money it's definitely coming from a place of wanting to keep her spirit alive so I love that about it and I would definitely go watch it if I were you guys and give Kristen Serrato the girl who plays Selena some love on Instagram because she's amazing but yeah it's just overall a really great show regardless of its wigs or costumes but if you really look beneath the surface it's such a great project and I hope you all watch it if you are fans of Selena so yeah but yeah I'm planning on getting more Selena pops in the future but this is the one that I have for now and I'm really really happy with this one so if you guys want to see more Selena pop videos be sure to comment down below but yeah I love you guys so much and I hope you guys have an amazing day bye